Well, actually, it's not a Justin Bieber song. He's just featured in that song. The one that goes like, do 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 Before we get into the video, I want to quickly let you guys know that I am running another Juniper contest. This time, you guys have a chance of winning, get this, my Murder Mystery 2 Godly Knife. I think it has to be done. One of you deserves it a lot more than I do, because I already got my dentist knife. That's all I need. I don't need the Tide's knife. As much as I love it, I am going to give it away. So. Just click the link in the description below. It's super, super easy to enter. It's just a one-click entry, and then you have a chance of winning. So definitely go do that. But anyways, let's get into it. Hey, everybody, and welcome to another Roblox adventure. Today, we are escaping the supermarket obby. Um, where am I? Am I... I'm in the I'm in a supermarket right now. What am I doing here? Why am I in here? Why don't I leave? I want to go home. Hey, hey, me too. Let's get out of this dump. Oh wait, what? The doors are locked. Why are what? Uh oh. Uh, why are the doors locked? Why are we locked into? Oh, I can't go that direction. That guy's bored. That person over there is saying the manager is mad. What's that person saying? I want to see what they're saying. Eh. Oh, I can't, I can't see that far. Oh, so why is the manager mad? Hmm, I guess that's something we're gonna figure out. Wow, let's get to it then. All right, what's this guy saying here? Hmm, I need to think of a, I need to think of a voice for this guy. Let's see, someone who works at a supermarket. It's probably his first job. He kind of looks like a teenager. You know, he's got that trendy, cool haircut. So he's probably younger. The manager's gone mad. The shop isn't getting enough sales, so he locked all the customers in. Oh wow, that is really oh wow, you can't you can't do that. You can't just lock customers in because they're not buying enough stuff. That is really messed up. I gotta say. And now it's turning into a complete ruckus because everything is spilling. There's cereal, there's ketchup and mustard. At least I hope that's ketchup and mustard. Wait, hold on. These are gigantic. These are huge. These are Oh, I have turned into mustard. <laughs> okay. Anyways, wait, hold on. This is a really Where is this supermarket because are we are we in a skyscraper? I'm looking out into into the vast sky and it there's nothing in sight. I look down and there's nothing below. How high in the sky are we? Wow. Okay. Oh, they have a playroom. What? This is an amazing supermarket. I wish all supermarkets were like this. Having a playroom? Oh, man. Well, anyways, now we got to get past the hot sauce and barbecue sauce. Oh, I would love some barbecue sauce right now. I really need to stop playing food-related games in Roblox when I'm hungry in real life. And you guys probably do that, too, is you probably watch videos where there's a lot of food involved, and then you have to go and get food. Food or something you just have to I remember I do that I no one even remember I do that all the time whenever I, I'm watching YouTube videos is uh, if I all of a sudden see something like some food and I'm really hungry I will pause the video I'll go I'll make sure I take care of it and then I come right back but I can't do that right now because we need to get through this we need to escape the supermarket because if we don't then uh, I don't know. I don't know. We're, we're gonna spend all our money on all the products because the manager's forcing us to. What a mess! And you're gonna have to clean it all up <laughs> because you work here. Oh, we have to go this way. I see. This guest has got the right idea. Okay, and then you go boom. Just like that. See? Just like that. Guess you go to the Codex. The Clo Clodex. Clodex. Clo yeah. I don't know much about cleaning supplies. Uh, <laughs> oh, now we can see what they're saying. The manager is mad and I'm hungry. Oh, <gasps> me too. I'm going to eat right after I record this video. Hold on, is this going to... Oh, slippery. Okay. Whoa. What is this on the... Are these fish sticks? Are these fish sticks on the ground? Why is the ice cream with the fish? Oh, because it's actually... I'm. That's a stupid question. It's because it's in the, it's in the cooling area, the freezer. That's why. Okay, well, oh, oh, come on. Oh, was that my first death? It was my first death. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Oh, wait, what, what? Wait, 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 Okay. Man, I really need a haircut. Look at this. Let's see how low my hair goes. My hair is going down all the way to, uh, past my nose. My hair usually is not this long. I usually get it cut way before I let it get to this point. It's really, it's really hard doing the obby whenever my hair is covering my eyes like this. 
Oh, wow. Some people actually have their hair like this, too. Okay, <laughs> I'm so distracted right now. I like doing my Dan impression right here. I like I like doing the Dan TDM haircut. <laughs> it's just like this. There you go. Hey, everyone! Dan here. <laughs> yeah. Hair is weird. Hair is super weird how different someone can look just by the- Did you guys see what was just happening right there? Those two were like glitching through each other. Okay, I can't go here, can I? No. Okay, we're gonna have to go this way then. I don't even need to jump over these. I can just jump around them. Oh, I did a bunch of body parts sliding by. That's really dark. And here we go. Through the jungle gym. I don't know why there's a jungle gym in here, but okay. Yeah. Ooh, I don't know why this stuff kills you either. It's a deadly jungle gym. Ball pits! Ball pits are so much fun, but they are so unsanitary. They are disgusting. Oh, man. The amount of stuff you can find in ball pits is just gross. It makes you never want to go into a ball pit again. I actually apologize for telling you guys about that because if you loved ball pits, well, you won't anymore. If you if you ever find out the kind the kinds of stuff that people lose in ball pits or that you can run into when you're in a ball pits or just how many different people have been inside of ball pits. Oh, gross. <laughs> Anyways, uh, they are fun though. They're fun. If you do have a clean one, if you have your own, oh, could you imagine having your own ball pit? Oh, that's why. That's why there's a jungle gym. We'll see that in a second. We gotta go down the slide. Wee! Wait, what? Uh oh. Am I stuck in the. I'm stuck in the slide. <laughs> oh, great. So I didn't get to actually slide out properly. Oh, and then you go into the ball pit. Oh, that would be so much fun. Man, this is really awesome, actually. This is a really, this is a really nice supermarket. So I get it now, though. I see on the other side there. So we're probably going to go through there and then over there. And that's why there's a jungle gym is because there's a McDonald's in the supermarket. There's always McDonald's in like Walmart and stuff. So I can see why there'd be a jungle gym. It kind of makes sense now. And this also, it's also a really good idea because then if parents are shopping and the kids are really bored, then they can just go to the jungle gym. That's great. Why don't all supermarkets have jungle gyms? Oh, I can't believe it. Okay. Anyways, if I was a parent, and I had to go shopping and I didn't want my kid screaming at me all the time. I'll just send them off to the jungle gym. What is going on here? Why is... What? Uh, okay, wait, hold on. There, it's going through the wall. I think the idea is it's supposed to like splat on the wall. <laughs> uh, uh huh. It's like a, it's like a big food fight happening here. Why is it even... Why is it doing this? <gasps> is there faces on those bananas? Oh, no, I don't think so. Okay, no. I thought there were faces. <laughs> okay, and then we go through, and then we go like that. What? Da uh, what? 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 How did that? No. No, no, no. How did that hit me? Hold on. It's okay. And then we let that one go. And then we let that one go. Okay, the oranges do have mouths, though. You can see that right there. They got a little bit of a mouth. Gross. Let's go into the bookstore. All right, whatever you say boy man okay oh and this is the maze oh i see 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 oh how curious okay well then where are we supposed to go in these mazes these mazes are always so difficult and then we go not here wow okay uh i definitely thought bookstores in real life are pretty much mazes they are just so large all the time wait hold on how do i okay hold on do i want to go i don't want to go this way if i already been here yes <laughs> just being in a bookstore makes me yawn <laughs> Now, there's nothing wrong with reading. Just, I have this problem where if I'm reading a book, no matter what happens, even if I just had 18 cups of coffee and I'm super energetic, if I start reading a book, I will pass out. I will just fall asleep and there's nothing I can do about it. No matter how good the book is, no matter how badly I want to read a book, I will fall asleep within 10 minutes of reading a book. I do this thing sometimes where if I can't sleep, um, I don't really do this anymore, but I, okay, where am I supposed to go? Is there a left side? I'm supposed, I don't, I'm confused. So I've already tried, I've already tried going there. What about here? No, I've been there. No way, this is impossible. <laughs> this is, this is ridiculous. Anyways, as I was saying is I used to do this thing where, um, if I couldn't fall asleep, I would just... I would just read a book <laughs> and then uh, no matter what, if I was having a lot of trouble going to bed that night, a book would just make me out lights out, you know? Okay, this is crazy. This is crazy. I, I, I don't know where to go. It seems, doesn't this seem impossible? Like I feel like I've explored literally every single option 
multiple times. Are you supposed to walk through something? Are you supposed to walk through a wall like this? No. Okay, well, I'm going to skip this stage because I don't like it. 40 Robux to skip a stage? Oh my goodness me. Man, things are getting expensive. Okay, so now I reset character. Boom! I just killed myself in the library. And now... Boom! Yeah! So, okay, I want to see how do you actually get out of there. Uh, this all seems completely closed off. How would... Oh, you're just supposed to walk through it. You see, yes. See, I didn't know that. I tried. I did try. Oh! I still have lemon water here. Mm. Oh, I love lemon water. Oh, I haven't done this in a while. <laughs> Hello! You can just barely see me. It's like you're looking at me through the fog. Ooh! I can make my face look really weird. Well, then whenever I do it right here. Hello! <laughs> All right. Uh, anyways. Okay. So I'm supposed to climb this. And there's some construction going on in this here, in this here, uh, in this here, what you call it? In this here shop, in this here shoe, supermarket. Hmm. Okay. Okay, I feel you. I feel that. Yeah, sure. <gasps> French fries falling out of the McDonald's. Oh my goodness me, that is very unsanitary. They really need to clean this up. Okay, and what about right here too? Burgers falling out of Burger King? Well, go figure. It's a lot of grease. Oh my goodness, all the grease on the ground. Greasy burgers, greasy ground. Greasy ground from Burger King. I don't know what I'm saying anymore. <laughs> well, these are very interesting looking shirts. The colors are huge. They're like the size of the entire torso. Where am I? I'm right, okay, here we go. All right. So we get through this, unless they're ladies' shirts, because some ladies wear shirts like that. Hmm, the door is broken. We will have, we will have through the storage room. <laughs> you see, didn't quite say full sentence, but that's okay. Oh, so I'm supposed to go through here. I can't go this way. Who's that other guy that looks exactly like you? Is that your evil twin? Oh, <gasps> okay, well, let's go this way then. Ha! Oh, oh man, it's in a storage room. It's a big storage room. Very inefficient, the way they stacked everything like this, whenever really they could have just had wait a second why does my face light up when i'm facing the wall Ooh, how interesting perhaps there is something on the other side oh look at that nike boxes oh man so now they're selling a bunch of nikes up here hmm very interesting okay oh where are we now are we where are we in the oh wait a second are we in the vents why is there acid in the vents are we in the sewers oh no we're in the vents okay well I'm sure that supermarkets probably do have pretty gross looking vents, if I do say so myself. Okay, where am I now? I am now, okay, I went through there. Another broken door. Looks like we're gonna have to go through the meat freezer. Oh man, okay, well, through the meat freezer it is. <laughs> Ew, this meat's all moldy and gross. Oh, I don't like it. I don't like it at all. It has a very chilly vibe in here, though. I like it a lot. I do like that. If there's something that I do like, it's that. It's that. That was done very well. So, good job, Packstabber. Good job at making things look cold. <laughs> I know that's a very kind of obscure compliment. Hey, there we go. Man, we are good. Okay, we can't actually go through there. I saw the finish. I saw the finish in the distance. Oh, oh where are we now? Where are you now? Justin Bieber's song, for those who don't get the reference. Okay. Well, anyways. Well, actually, it's not a Justin Bieber song. He's just featured in that song. The one that goes like, do 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 be do It's a really, really odd theme. Never really understood that song too much. Huh. Oh, no, I was so... I was so close. Oh, it was just a very narrow path there. Oh, man. Okay. Well, that's okay. Yeah. Yeah. Some of that. Some of that. Boom. Ooh. All right. All right. Here we go. Okay. And now what? Now I think we're I think we're almost there. You know, we're kind of wrapping it up. We're kind of getting to, you know, we're getting to the bottom of things. You know, we're kind of sort of, you know, we're doing some good. We're doing pretty good. Oh, <gasps> 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 oh, there's the food. <laughs> there's the food coming through the wall. I wonder if it can kill me. I feel like it could. I don't even know if I want to try. <laughs> Quick, run home. Whatever you say, boy man, here we go. <laughs> Do a little bit of that zigzag, a little bit of zigzag. It'd be pretty good if all of a sudden the road maybe changed direction. Then I would get really messed up. Okay, well, there you go. We escaped the supermarket, ladies and gentlemen. Let me see what this guy's saying over here. Well done. We have made it from the crazy store. 
You still look worried even though you have a happy face there though. I'm not, unless we turn unless we turn that smile upside down. Here we go. Rob, I want you to I want you to flip him 180 degrees. There we go. Look at that. You see, it almost looks like he's happy even though his face is just upside down, even though his eyes are below his mouth. It's a very cool optical illusion there. Anyways, ladies and gentlemen. I would like to thank you so much for joining me for another Roblox adventure. Gotta grab the blue path as always. If you enjoyed, please do remember to leave a like. Maybe even subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. This is really weird. I'm doing an outro and still playing. Usually I take my hands off just like that. Okay, there we go. <sighs> Where was I in the outro? Leave a like. If you like the video, make sure to click like. That's not what I usually say. And then if you want to subscribe, then subscribe. I'm really blowing this. Subscribe to channel. Don't forget to check out my I Love Cats t-shirt. You can get it at DennisDaily.com or there's a link in the description below. And the Sir Meows a Lot plush toy is now available and he is on sale. So you can go to DennisDaily.com for that is wet and get yourself a Sir Meows a Lot plush toy. He's so cute. You can take the tie off as well. It's really great. I love him so much. He's very cuddly. He's a very cuddly plush toy. So you should get one for yourself as well. Other than that, though, guys, I will see you in the next one.